The protests and complaints about Austin School District renting space to a church that does not allow gay members, the district is responding in a unique way. As KXAN education reporter Tom Miller explains, the AISD is using some of the money to help students participate in the Austin Pride Parade. For nearly a year, demonstrators have met outside Austin ISD's Performing Arts Center every Sunday, protesting against the group gathering inside. Celebration Church. Former Austin ISD student Naomi Wilson is among them. I was hoping that I could talk to some of the members and help them realize that the policies are offensive. That policy states in part homosexuality, bisexual conduct, bestiality, incest, pornography, or any attempt to change one's sex or disagreement with one's biological sex is sinful and offensive to God. Now, the district is taking $10,000 from the $182,000 it's received in rent payments and using it to boost student participation in Austin's Pride Parade. Those staffers and parents and community volunteers that organize our participation in the parade have traditionally had to raise their own funds. The money will help bus students pay for water and security. We reached out to Celebration Church for comment but haven't heard back. However, Texas values didn't mince words. They need to get their priorities straight. Instead of sending kids to these over-sexualized events, they should really be focusing on the failing schools in the district. Wilson also isn't particularly happy with the move, arguing it doesn't go far enough. It's definitely a step in the right direction, um, but they have to remember that it's almost insulting how small that step was. A battle over the district's values, with both sides unsatisfied. In Austin, Tom Miller, KXAN News. The district says that $10,000 is in fact just a start and that it is open to increasing the amount of money depending on the need. Celebration Church is just one of more than 40 churches and 300 organizations the district rents its facilities out to. If you're wondering why Austin ISD doesn't simply end this issue by not renting to Celebration Church, the Texas Attorney General weighed in last year. In a letter to the district last September, Ken Paxton's office explained that changing the rules to target Celebration Church would be discriminatory. The letter says, quote, the Constitution and state law require the district to provide churches with equal access to facilities it opens to community organizations. So either all groups can rent AISD facilities or none.